I started at IBM when my husband died. He died at 47 and I was 43. So I had not worked. I had done a lot of work. After we married, I stayed home with the kids and I redid the houses and we'd move and then we'd do another house and I did a lot of painting and a lot of whatever needed in the houses. Uh, but then when he passed away, I knew I needed to go to work and I worked at IBM and I retired from IBM and when I did that, I went down to Solomon's and I lived there 13 years before I came here. And I have a house that I was able to purchase and it was one of the first houses, an 1879 house that uh, Mr. Solomon had built on the water. So we did a lot of read. I did a lot and my daughter and son-in-law helped me and we redid the whole inside of the house. So it's really neat down there. And I overlooked the water. I had some surgery and I was left with my kidneys. I would get infections and if I got an infection, then I would faint. So I fainted a couple of times and so my daughter and son-in-law said, this is it, we're finding a spot. So they found Grand Oaks and thank goodness they did. It's the best. It's secure, safety wise. People are so friendly. Everyone is just, will help you. All you need to do is press your button you wear around your neck. You're near the hospital if you need help which is good because I use their physical therapy. Just go down the hall, around the corner, down the elevator, and I'm there. So uh, food is delicious. There's no cleaning. There's no laundry. You just sit and be luxurious. It's wonderful. <laughs>